garden was started in 1958. 1959, the first plants were planted out here and started over near where the duck pond is. The Hanover House, uh, which was built in 1716, is 300 years old this year. The house itself is uh, historic properties. Hunt Cabin, which was built in 1826, that is um, actually here and on our, is our management. Our central feature in the South Carolina Botanical Garden is our uh, natural heritage garden. It brings the ecosystems of South Carolina into the garden. You know, instead of just walking through a trail where you say, oh yeah, well this, this is, these are plants that grow in the mountains, it actually takes you into the mountains. Essentially what we've done is build a trail that takes people in a matter of an hour or two from the mountains all the way to the sea. All the, the major ecosystems of South Carolina are represented there and that was a way really to gain relevance for the South Carolina Botanical Garden to really represent South Carolina. One of our major pushes is to show people what they can do in their own home landscape with plants in South Carolina. You walk down the trail, you actually can get lost in these exhibits because they're big. So when you walk in below the hunt cabin, you're walking down through bridges into um, the Cove Forest. It sort of continues down the trails. You walk through the Piedmont Forest and then you come out into something that we call the Piedmont Prairie, down into the coastal plain and then into the Maritime Forest and you know, you're at the beach. Uh, geology Museum located here at the Botanical Garden is an incredible feature. You know, you can see everything from the skull of a Tyrannosaurus rex to the largest crystal of a certain type that was ever collected in North America. Around the Geology Museum is another really neat uh, new feature of the garden, which is the, um, the Desert Garden or the Southwestern Collection. The world never forgets the choices you make, and they end up living in that world that was created by your choices.